Above the Japanese island of Hokkaido, a fireball blazes through the night. Broadcast by Japanese television, these images show a missile launched by North Korea on Saturday. It was South Korea who initially alerted the public, with Pyongyang only confirming the launch the following day. The missile landed in the exclusive economic zone of Japan, according to Tokyo. The firing is an escalating provocation against the international community as a whole, and naturally we severely lodged a protest against it. The safety and security of Japanese people are the most important things over anything else. Japanese authorities affirmed that the object launched was an intercontinental ballistic missile. According to experts, Pyongyang wanted to test a missile with solid fuel. It's a form of technology that the North Korean regime has been attempting to master, since it is easier to store and more difficult to detect. This is the second North Korean missile to land in Japan's EEZ zone since November 2022. Tensions in the region have been growing in recent months, with an increasing number of missile drills from North Korea and, in return, joint military manoeuvres from Seoul and the US. The launch follows several days of simulation exercises between these two allies in preparation for a potential nuclear attack from Pyongyang.